In this problem, we're being asked to take this fraction and convert it to a decimal. You should know that a fraction is really a division problem. It's the numerator divided by the denominator. So in this case, it's 9 divided by 20. So if you want to convert this to a decimal, you can just do the division. If you have a calculator handy, uh, it's a really quick and easy thing to do. Um, if you don't have a calculator handy, you can still just do the division. So this is 9 divided by 20, and you might think, how's this going to work? Because 9 doesn't have any room uh, for 20 to go into it. Well, we can stick a decimal point here, which just as a placeholder, we're going to ignore it for the time being, and then put add, add as many zeros as you need. So I'm just going to start with one zero, and I'll think of this as 90. So how many 20s go into 90? Well, uh, 20 times 4 would be 80. I think that's good. So we'll do that. And this gets us 10. Now again, there are no 20s that fit into 10, so I'm just going to add another 0 and bring it down. How many 20s in 100? Aha, there are 5. 5 times 20 is 100. So that's a remainder of 0. And now I just put my decimal point in where it goes. So we get 0 0.45. So 9 twentieths is 0.45. So that is how to convert a fraction to a decimal. Although I'll have to warn you, sometimes you'll get fractions where this would go on forever. You'd get some value that repeats forever and ever. So this one was easy because it's, it's what's called a terminating decimal. It ends, but not all of them are like that. So watch out for that in the future.